This is an in-service training program presented by Nutrition Care Systems. Today's topic, gout and diet management. Upon completing this in-service, you will be able to define gout, define what causes gout, and list foods to avoid when a person has gout. So what exactly is gout? It's an intensely painful swelling of the joints, and you can see from the picture how painful that looks, most often the big toe, fingers, or other part of the foot, caused by excess uric acid in the body and the formation of needle-like urate crystals in the joint. Foods that are high in purines can lead to an increase in uric acid in the body. What actually causes gout? The exact cause is really unknown, but men do tend to get gout more often than women, and there are some risk factors associated with gout. First one would be heavy alcohol use, especially beer. Diabetes, obesity is also a risk factor. Someone with sickle cell anemia. High blood pressure is a risk factor for gout. Kidney disease, and then certain medications are also a risk factor. So what are the symptoms of a gout attack? And a gout attack can last several days, but some of the symptoms can be sudden pain, fever, chills, and fatigue. So a diet restriction for someone with gout, we would want them to limit sugary drinks, those that are high in fructose, limit alcohol, especially beer, limit red meats, in particular avoid liver, Limit lean meats to four to six ounces daily, such as chicken, fish, pork. Avoid shellfish, especially anchovies, herring, sardines, mussels, scallops, trout, haddock, mackerel, and tuna. Purines in vegetables are okay to consume. Low-fat dairy may help lower uric acid level in the body. And then we also want them to make sure they consume at least eight, eight ounce glasses of water daily. Other foods to limit would be asparagus, lentils, dried beans, mushrooms, dried peas, spinach, and broth. So in summary, by controlling weight and avoiding foods high in purines, this can decrease or eliminate gout attacks. Take a short quiz on gout and diet management. Question number one, what is gout? A, intensely painful swelling of the joints. B, it's caused by excess uric acid in the body. C, it most often happens in the big toe or other part of the foot. Or D, all the above. And the answer to question number one, what is gout? Be D, all of the above. Question number two, what are the risk factors for gout? A, obesity, B, drinking too much water, C, diabetes, or D, both A and C? And the answer to question number two, what are the risk factors for gout? That would be both A and C, obesity and diabetes. Question number three, what are the symptoms of a gout attack? A, fever, B, chills, C, fatigue, or D, all of the above? And the answer to question number three, what are the symptoms of a gout attack? And that would be D, all of the above, fever, chills, and fatigue.
Question number four, true or false? Someone with gout should limit red meats, especially liver. And of course the answer is true. Someone with gout should limit red meats, especially liver. Question number five, true or false? Alcohol, especially beer, is okay to consume when you have gout. And the answer is false. Beer, especially, is something that you should not consume when you have gout. Thank you for your participation in today's program. Our goal is for you to use this information in your daily work. We hope you are well served today and every day. If you would like more information about our in-service training programs or consulting dietitian services, please contact us at 1-800-761-9200 or nutritioncaresystems.com.